I follow you guys. Oh. I absolutely love your tips. Oh, <laughs> thank, <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. Really nice to meet you were. Thanks. Yes. All in all, my tickets were 65. What was it? 320, 240. Welcome to rainy Manchester. It's race day today, and we're going to be racing from the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford, the home of Manchester United, all the way to Wembley, the 90,000 seater stadium, which is of course home to the English national football teams and hosts numerous cup finals throughout the year. It's a football arena, it's a football arena, the powerhouses of the UK. Liam tells me they're the biggest stadiums in the whole of the country. This is typical Manchester weather. And so we don't want to be here for very long. I'm going to be taking the train, Liam, how are you getting there? I'm taking the flight with British Airways. I think we should run because we need to get out of this rain and make our way to London. I don't know who's going to win this one. I've got a good feeling, let's go. Okay, well here I am in the pouring rain. I am absolutely soaked, so I want to get out of here as quickly as possible. I'm now heading to try and find a cab to take me to Manchester Airport, Terminal 3. And you know what? Manchester United, not as good as West Ham United, are they? Reigning European champions, so I want to get out of here, get back to London where there are some real stadiums. So first stop for me is going to be the tram. We're going to go to Old Trafford Station. Once I get there, I think it's about 15 minutes to Manchester Piccadilly, where I'm going to take the train, which takes about two hours to get into London, Euston, and I can hop on the Metropolitan Line at Euston Square, all the way to Wembley, make that final sprint down Wembley Way. I think we'll have this one in the bag. Hey mate, go to Manchester Airport, please. Okay, well, despite the rain, that was a good, fast start. I managed to find a taxi immediately that's taking me to the airport now. There's a five pound surcharge, but you know what? Speed is the name of the game, so I really don't mind. At the tram station, there is no tram. Okay, it's slightly more complicated than it makes out because I can't just take any train to Manchester, like it said. But the next one, which goes to Piccadilly, which is the right one, which should take me to where I'm going, so could be there, but it's gonna be five minutes. I've got five minutes. I've got five minutes. Have I? We're on the move. Let's go. It's got real busy on here. Oh, but we're at the beginning. I can't run because there's a million people. Okay, we're off. Clear path ahead. Scans platform six. All right, let's do it. Cheers, I'll see you later. Okay, well, I've never been to Manchester Airport before, and as I often find myself in these races, I don't really know where I'm going, so looking for some handy signage at the moment. Just pulling out of Manchester Piccadilly Station now and heading to Euston. We are on time, to the minute. This is great. Steaming our way down to London right now. Okay, well, after a little bit of a hold up at the gate, we are now boarding, so fingers crossed we'll still have an on time departure. Hi, how you doing? So I've taken my seat, ready to fly to Manchester. It's about five minutes until the scheduled departure time, but people are still boarding at the moment, so I feel like we might be a little a bit delayed. The time in the sky is only 30 minutes though, so it's a super speedy up and down. So I've got a nice wide seat here in the exit row today, and for a very quick flight, this actually feels really comfortable. I actually had a standard class ticket, but they have the first class seating, but they sell it as two different things. They sell a true first class where they serve food and drink, don't need that today, but they also sell the standard premium, which is where I've decided to sit today. It's an extra 25 quid to sit here, which I think is well worth it to get these seats that are wider, more comfortable. 25 quid for like two and a whatever bit hours, but I think this is a pretty good deal and I'm happy to pay it. Okay, the good news is that I'm now in the air, soaring back towards London, but the bad news is I was about 25 minutes delayed before taking off, so those minutes could be crucial. But as we fly towards the finish line, feeling good. We're well into the journey. I'm going heading all the way down to coach C, I think, to go and get myself a little snackaroo. 
Oh my god, there's a doggy! I knew this was going to be a good journey. Boy, it's annoyingly cloudy out there, otherwise I would definitely be able to see Wembley right now. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye. Okay, finally off the plane after a little wait at the end there. This is the final important stretch. There should be no passport security, so it should be easy enough. Okay, well I'm here, but where's my driver? Where's my taxi? I can't see him. We've arrived pretty much on time. I've got no idea how his journey went. Just looking out for you now. I'm, uh, I'm on le level one, row R. Okay, soon soon, right. Okay, well, apparently they told him to go to level three in my absolute level one. So, oh, even more minutes being added on there, but at least he's on his way now. Hi, mate. That is not good. Lovely timing, just missed a train. The board is empty, not a good sign. Wembley Stadium. Let's go. Could come across Liam any minute right now. Quite a good time here, the traffic hasn't been too bad. Final stretch now. The big question is going to be, is Liam here or not? I also don't know where he's coming from. I don't know if he got a taxi or if he was getting a tube. If he's getting a taxi, maybe he's ended up even closer to the stairs. We're meeting on the stairs. <laughs> Thanks, mate. Thank you. See you later. Oh, OK. There you go. I've made it. I'm at the end of Wembley Way. There is the stadium behind me. There is the famous arch. Oh no. I really thought I'd done it with some speedy driving at the end there. I really thought I'd done it. Be honest, how long, how long have you been here for? Honestly, about 45 seconds. Oh, <laughs> you're joking me. Oh, oh, a little bit too late. Oh, I don't believe it. Well played. Well done. Good race. Well, we're here, the glorious arch of Wembley Stadium, and it's a loser, but this, I reckon, is our closest ever. It was genuinely, you know, seconds in it, and if I hadn't had a tiny bit of traffic coming out of Heathrow, I would have beaten you, but, you know, easy to say that now. I feel absolutely gutted, though. I think this was under a minute. It's really got to be one of our quickest. So to break down the journey um, and the costs, I paid about £2.40 for my tram, £3.20 for the tube. I paid £40 for my train ticket. I paid 25 quid to upgrade to Standard Premier. So all in all, that was £70 and 60 pence for my journey. Liam? Well, mine was a bit more expensive. I had to pay £35 for a cab from Old Trafford to the airport. My BA flight was £74 one way coming into London Heathrow. And finally, quite a pricey Uber from Heathrow to Wembley at 60 quid. Well, a little bit expensive that one and also lost, but only by a fraction. I'm going to give you one more chance. I'll race you to the top. Three, Ready? two, one, go. 